Uh, so the first thing we're going to do is uh, to landmark exactly where we're going to go for an intramuscular injection into the deltoid. So we use the deltoid because it's a really safe muscle to use, very little chance of hitting any blood vessels or nerves. Um, and it's a really nice accessible muscle. So we want to want to make sure that our um, customer or patient is wearing a, a top so that we can fully access the shoulder. So once we've got that and we've got the shoulder fully accessible, we want to be able to find the acromion process. That's the foot right at the end of the shoulder. It's where the shoulder joint um, it finishes. From that point, it's really important that we move away from the shoulder joint so that we don't inject into the shoulder joint. So we want to go down two and a half centimeters in the midpoint from that position. So this is the area that we're going to be wanting to inject into. So in terms of injection technique, it's really important that we hold our syringe correctly. So we want to hold our syringe like a pen. Um, holding it like this gives it really good control. So when we're giving an intramuscular injection, we're going to be stretching the skin. So on, if I show you on the actual skin here, we'd be stretching it nicely here um, to make sure that we're going into the, into the muscle. Helps to desensitise the area as well. So I'm going to be injecting into the injection pad today, um, but holding the injection like a pen, we're going to remove the sheath at the last possible moment, stretching the skin. We're going to start as close as we can to the surface of the skin and we're just going to quickly and confidently inject. We're then going to uh, depress the plunger nice and slowly, taking about five seconds to deliver that vaccine, if it's about a, a 0.5 of a mil, and then quickly and confidently remove that needle. When that comes out, it goes straight into the sharp spin.